With the winter storm looming, Monroe County Executive Adam Bello joining Mayor Evans and other officials to address contingency plans for the forecasted conditions. This follows a state of emergency declaration, as mentioned, and encouragement from the county executive to close schools into the holiday weekend. Christian Garzon joins us live now with more. Christian? Well, Natalie, this storm is set to blanket a large portion of the nation with freezing cold and nasty temperatures. Our region is not going to be an exception. We could see winds as high as 50 to 60 miles per hour with temperatures dropping rapidly. County Executive Adam Bello is urging all residents to avoid any unnecessary travel. And said power outages are expected and everyone in the county should be prepared for that possibility. Also weighing in here today at the uh, center here, Mayor Malik Evans said the vulnerable folks in Rochester need protection during this storm. And he declared a state of emergency that went into effect at noon today. This is also due to the water main break Alex was talking about. Uh, Bello said we will see flash freezing tomorrow morning and blowing snow that might cause whiteout conditions. Now due to the expected weather tomorrow, all Monroe County office buildings will be closed to the public. Bello said he knows this is going to be tough over the Christmas weekend. He said travel could be dangerous and perhaps impossible. He said this emergency operations center here will open at 6 tomorrow. Earlier this morning, I met with municipal leaders and school district superintendents from across the county to share the most up-to-date weather information and to ensure that there's a coordinated response between all of our towns, our villages, the county and the city of Rochester. Uh, again, just, just commenting on the um, state of emergency. This allows us to have fast action. If, if, if we need to open up more shelters in the city, it gives us that ability. If it gives, uh, if, if in the event that people may lose power tomorrow, um, it, it, it allows us to be able to respond um, on that as well. Now, Bello said if you lose power and your situation is life threatening, call 911. If it's not life threatening and you lose power, please call RGE. Live in Rochester, Christian Garzon, News 8, John Nedley, right back to you. Christian, thank you very much. City residents and business owners with questions about our center hours, the boil water advisory at large, or any issues with water supply, again, are encouraged to call 311.